December 28, 2015, at the McGraw Center in Jacksonville, Florida. She was born in Randolph, Vermont, to Evelyn Hayward James and Charles Robert Ballou in June of 1948. She earned her LPN through the New York Board of Cooperative Educational Services and her RN through New York Regents External Degree Program. She worked as a nurse with a specialty in labor and delivery at Putnam Hospital Center in New York and Elliott Hospital at Hiscock Clinic in Manchester, New Hampshire. She possessed many talents, photography, woodworking, sewing, and building computers were some of her many self-taught skills. She lived in Vermont, Massachusetts, New York, New Hampshire, Germany, and Arizona before settling in Lake City, Florida. Sue met everyone with a knowing smile and made good friends everywhere she went. She was proud of her family. She leaves behind her three children, Christine, Joanne, and Andrew, five grandchildren, Marissa, Rachel, Emily, Sean, and Abigail, a brother, Jerry, and a sister, Kimberly. A celebration of her life will be held at Randolph, Vermont in June of 2016, and she will be greatly missed by all of you. So I thought it would be appropriate for the sermon today just to spend some time. I just wondered, is anybody, before I get into my sermon on the resurrection, does anybody have a testimony about Sue that you'd like to just share as we just take a few moments to remember her? Yes, ma'am. Sue, probably one of my best friends. I didn't get to get to know her long. She never complained. Never. And that woman was in so much pain all most of the time for the last three or four years. But I know where she is. And I know God has his arms around her. Amen. Anybody else? The last Sunday she was here when she came out of the truck or whatever she came out of and started in and I hugged her and, and followed her in. A, an emotion or a feeling came over me and I wanted to just touch her knowing she was going to heaven. I, I mean, it was like, oh, let me hang on to you because I know where you're going in a week or two and I want to be there and I want to share that joy with you. So that's it. take your Bibles, please. 